Are women turning to cannabis for menopause symptom relief? A survey offers a glimpse into cannabis and CBD use among women in midlife. Hot flashes and sleep or mood changes are well known, troublesome symptoms that may occur during perimenopause and menopause. Now, one survey suggests nearly 80% of midlife women use cannabis to ease certain symptoms, such as mood issues and trouble sleeping. Mounting numbers of U.S. states have legalized marijuana for medical or recreational use in recent years. This wave of acceptance runs alongside skepticism in some quarters concerning FDA-approved menopause treatment options, including hormone therapy. But a lack of long-term research data surrounding cannabis use has led one Harvard expert to question how safe it may be, even while acknowledging its likely effectiveness for certain menopause woes. Survey reports on who uses cannabis, why, and how. The new Harvard-led survey, published in the journal Menopause, looked at patterns of cannabis use in 131 women in perimenopause, the often years-long stretch before period C's, along with 127 women who had passed through menopause. Participants were recruited through online postings on social media sites and an online recruitment platform. Nearly all survey respondents were white and most were middle class, according to income reporting. Perimenopausal women reported worse menopausal symptoms than their postmenopausal peers as well as greater cannabis use to address their symptoms. More than 84% of participants reported smoking cannabis, while 78% consumed marijuana edibles, and nearly 53% used vaping oils. How might cannabis help menopause symptoms? It makes sense that midlife women reported cannabis improves anxiety, mood, and sleep, Dr. Hirsch says. The drug likely helps all of these symptoms by giving the prefrontal cortex the decision-making part of our brain. For many women, anxiety spikes during perimenopause, she notes. Common stressors during that time, such as aging parents or an emptying nest, add to the effects of dipping hormones. It's that feeling of, I can't turn my brain off. It's really disturbing because they get in bed and can't fall asleep so they're more tired, moody, and cranky the next day," she explains. Dimming the prefrontal cortex enables people to calm down. No research yet on long-term effects. Given a lack of clinical trials objectively testing the effectiveness and safety of cannabis to manage menopause symptoms, more research is clearly needed.